Let's find three equivalent fractions for two eighths. Here's how we'll do that. So we want to find another fraction that's equivalent. It has the same value as two divided by eight, just that the fraction has a different numerator and denominator. So first off, I can see that we can simplify two eighths. Two goes into two one time, and two goes into eight four times. So one fourth and two eighths, they are equivalent fractions. If you divide two by eight or one by four, you get the same thing, 0 0.25, because they're equivalent. We could also take two eighths, and instead of dividing to simplify, we could multiply. We could multiply it by one, but that would just give us two eighths. Let's multiply it by two over two. Two over two, that's just one, two divided by two. But now we have two times two, that gives us four, eight times two, that gives us 16. So four sixteenths, that's another equivalent fraction to two eighths and one fourth. And if you divide four by 16, you get 0 0.25. Same thing as we did before. One last one. We could multiply it by something like seven over seven. That's one, we get 1456. That's another equivalent fraction for two eighths. This is Dr. B, thanks for watching.